Welcome to the first and last episode of Cooking with Mandy. Today you're going to watch me make dulce de leche cookies or galletas de dulce de leche. To make this recipe, I will need un huevo, 120 milliliters of dulce de leche, 120 milliliters of azúcar morena, 60 milliliters of azúcar, a pinch of salt, 2.4 milliliters of baking soda, 1.2 milliliters of baking powder, 40 milliliters of mantequilla, and 195 milliliters of flour. Preheat to 176 degrees Celsius. Mix in your flour, your baking soda, your baking powder, and your salt. The baking soda will react with the brown sugar, causing the cookies to rise in the oven. This common chemical reaction, a dual reaction, is often used in baking. This reaction will occur when an acidic ingredient such as brown sugar is added to the mixture. In a separate bowl, add in your mantequilla and your dulce de leche and mix it until it looks awesome like this. Add your azúcar and switch out your camera battery because you forgot to charge it like a pay student. Add your azúcar morena and then mix it together. Then decide to use a blender because you're lazy. Crack the huevo and then using the blender, mix it together. Using the blender, add in the dry ingredients to the wet ingredients until it's completely blended. Roll the dough in more azucar and then press them down with a fork. Since you have extra dough, you may want to make cookie bowls so you can fill them with ice cream and eat them later. Most ovens use all three types of heat transfer, conduction, convection, and radiation. The metal racks use conduction to transfer heat, the convection is used in the air of the oven, and the radiation is used to actually bake the cookies. After baking for 12 minutes, your galletas will turn out like this, a delicious Colombian treat made in your own house. Dulce de leche is a common ingredient in many Spanish desserts. I hope you enjoyed watching me make these amazing cookies.